right, this is going to be a quick video of me rambling on about the problem I'm having with the calipers here. Um, if you can, put in the comments if you have any ideas about a solution, but the options are not really wide, you know. I only got a few options here. Make sure you watch to the end of the video. I got a package that contains a few bolts that I'm going to put on in my next video. And if you know what they are, put in the comments here and see if you're right in the next video. Well, at the end of my last video, I mentioned that there was a major f***ing problem with the calipers I put on. So I got them back off, of course. It all started after I did those burnouts and I took the car to the shop. Uh, I did hear some squeaking and when I looked at the rotors, there was a big gouge on both sides uh, where the pads go. Now when I put them on, there was some complications. Uh, they were a little hard to squeeze on the rotors, but I just pushed the piston and the pad back and I was able to get the bracket and everything over the rotor. So I didn't think nothing of it until I saw the gouge in the rotors. And I looked at it real hard and it's not my first time doing brakes, so I figured it had to be a problem with the calipers, you know, because uh, YouTubers don't make mistakes. So I did some research online and sure enough, some engineer in Honda decided to make three different kind of calipers for each model of the EF Civic, you know. So the base model and the DX model and the SI model all have different calipers. What the f***? Well, actually the SI and the DX share the same kind of caliper. The other ones take a smaller rotor. And guess what? I got the ones with the smaller rotor that I got powder coated. All right, so let me explain first. These are the calipers I had on the car. And these are the extra ones I had on the shelf. And I figured I'd get them powder coated all nice. And I'd just swap them out and have some nice powder coated brake calipers. But no. So after I read in those Honda forums that the bracket here is different sizes on the different models. I came out here with some calipers of course and measured the distance in between here and they're like two thousandths difference and I figured damn well I like the powder coat but I'll switch them out and I'll get the other set powder coated later and I'll be able to run but then I, I thought maybe I should check them out a little more and as you can see there's slight differences in the casting and but the real difference is you ever played that game where it's got a picture of the same thing but if you look really close there's like subtle differences in the two pictures that's the game I was playing with this but yeah uh, you got to measure here with the calipers this distance and this distance here and of course uh, these ones are bigger than the, the ones that I got powder coated so of course I'm f pissed off because I paid too much money to get these things powder coated and my only option to run those right now is to get smaller rotors and who wants to do that uh, I'm probably gonna have to do that also I didn't even show you the best but look check this out in here uh, let me figure out a better and you see that in there that's from contact with the rotor man that's horrible scratch the powder coat right off of that thing Well, you know, it's like on the inside. There's a good shot of it. Also, the pistons are the same, so the seals and everything here and these things are the same. I can take the seals out of that and put them in this one and clean these up and use these ones. Because I got new rotors, they were under warranty. That's the result of my brake pads there. That don't look too good. I might go try to get different rotor, the smaller rotors for the standard model and run the powder coated ones because, I mean, I got them powder coated. Well, like I said, this is going to be a short video. If you've had this problem before, put in the comments what you did. 
or out of any of the options I recommended, what do you think I should do? And that's gonna be it. Cut to the little mystery box shit. All right, now these are the bolts that, I'm not gonna say what they are. If you can figure it out, put it in the comments. You want me to open it? Oh, no, you don't gotta open it. I was just about to say some springs. 